To start here, I am preheating a 12 inch cast iron skillet over medium heat. I'm going to add a quarter cup of oil and three tablespoons of butter. I'm gonna melt down the butter. And once that's melted down, I'm going to add half of an onion diced, one celery stick that I've chopped, and one medium carrot that I've chopped. I'm gonna add that right into my skillet and saute. I'm also going to add a pinch of salt, and I'm just going to combine that and continue my saute until the onions are translucent and the carrots are softened. Now I'm going to add two cloves of minced garlic. I'm going to combine this and continue the saute for about one more minute. Here I have one and a half pounds of chicken breast that I've cut into chunks, and I'm just going to add this into the pan, cook and saute. I'm going to be seasoning my chicken with a combination of celery salt, onion salt blend, garlic powder, marjoram, dried thyme, dried parsley, and a little bit of dried rosemary. And this is what's going to flavor and season this. And after everything's done, I will definitely taste it for salt and pepper. Now that my chicken is cooked, I am going to add seven tablespoons of all-purpose flour. And once I add all of the flour, I'm just going to work it in with the chicken and cook it for about one minute. Now I'm going to add three cups of low sodium chicken broth. I'm going to add it a cup at a time and just work it into my roux and allow it to thicken. Next, I'm going to add in one cup of whole milk. You could use evaporated milk and you can also use heavy cream to make things a lot creamier. I'm just working with whole milk today. So I'm just going to work that in, allow it to simmer until it's thickened, and then this is ready. I'll shut off the heat. To prepare the biscuits, I'm going to be using two and a half cups of self-rising flour. I'll add a pinch of salt, and I'm just gonna mix that with my hands. And I'm also going to be working with a combination of butter and butter flavored shortening. You could use all butter if that's what you prefer. I'm using six tablespoons. You could use a dough cutter to work this in. You can grate your frozen butter. I know a lot of people do that, but I'm just going to work it in with my hands. Now I'm going to add in one cup of buttermilk. And I'm just going to use this chopstick to sort of work it in. You could use a spoon. But this dough is going to be sticky and tacky. You definitely can work in the buttermilk to the dough and add extra flour if you want to roll out your biscuits and cut them. But I'm actually just going to scoop these with a scooper. Now I'm just going to scoop nine biscuits from this dough on the top of this cast iron skillet filled with this creamy chicken. I'm going to bake this in a preheated oven at 425 degrees Fahrenheit for about 20 minutes or until the biscuits are done. 
Now that my chicken and biscuits are done, I am going to brush a tablespoon of melted butter on the tops of my biscuits. And I'm also going to add some fresh chopped parsley and this is ready to serve. I hope you give this recipe a try. I hope you like it and thanks for watching.